Uh, this next one is called Canvas Sky. It's basically about when I was walking my dog and I had one of those moments where I looked up and the sky didn't even look real. It just kind of looked like a massive piece of artwork, so I wrote this. <coughs> Houses interrupt the art of the night sky. A canvas sky filled with beauty. Dark clouds invade the black sea as the stars peer through. Sudden light in the corner of my eye as the canvas changes. The night's eye gleaming through each interference. Slowly fading into the canvas black, waiting for another night's canvas sky. Yeah. Don't worry, they will get a little bit more upbeat about it. <laughs> uh, not now though. Uh, <laughs> this next one's called Fight For, and it's just kind of about how a bit like aimless in life and how I wish I wasn't. I want something to fight for. I need someone to love. I can't go with nothing, nothing to fight for in my life. I want that. I want to have the hardships, I want the thrill of the chase, I want something to work on, I can't go on at this pace. <laughs> this next one is uh, called A Fleeting Romance. It's about when you see a girl in life and um, you just wish that you're brave enough to go talk to them. And, yeah. <laughs> As I see you walk <laughs> past, my mind wanders into a future where we're together and, not, and all is good. I lose myself in hugs and giggles and spats and bills, but we're together and nothing matters. I think of how happy we will be if I was just brave enough to go talk to you, but then you're gone, on a train or a bus into the arms of your boyfriend. And I realise it was all just a fleeting romance in my head, then I drift to another and it never ends. <laughs> uh, this is uh, called Life Surrounding. It's uh, basically just when you get a little bit depressed in life and you just shut everyone off and basically act like a dick. And it was about when, <laughs> when I realised I was doing this. Yeah. There's times when I feel all alone in a sea of people, when all I can see is me, but all I need to do is open my eyes and I'll see you, all of you. I see how I'm surrounded by life and everyone in it. They will wake me up and I'll be out of this coma of depression and I'll be back again. And I keep pushing and I just need to open. This one's a little bit sillier. It's called Accompanied by Wind. And uh, literally the story behind this is I was riding home and the wind was in my direction. Yeah, that's it. <clears throat> Join me, wind, as I ride home. Push me away from that dastardly work. Give me home so I can rest. Let me ride with the speed of a horse. So with the wind on my side, I ride with a numb ass. I ride with sore legs. I ride accompanied by wind. <laughs> Twenty thirteen, what a dick. If twenty thirteen was a person I'd punch him in the face as he deserves it. And quite frankly I wouldn't stop at a punch, I'd carry up with a kick, brackets or two. As if twenty thirteen was a person I wouldn't be his friend, I wouldn't have anything to do with it. Him as well. Twenty thirteen's a dick. Thank you very much. <laughs>